Arrow Bolt. Do you want me to go there? in their entire yes? Are you in danger? Let me at him! Oh, crazy missiles! Oh, 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 Anything else?
rack up another victory for the commander! Clear. It's a clear shot to the research facility from here. We're well stocked with supplies. Things are looking good. There is something, however, that I'm curious about. Are Nikkei's allowed to engage in operations on the surface without a commander? Huh? I don't remember ever doing that. Then what about conducting corporate espionage to spy on another squad? So they say. Anyway, what's our next move, Rappi? <sighs> Show yourself. If you're not out here by the time I count to three, I'll open fire. Three. <sighs> Two. Ugh, what a killjoy. I was going to come out when the timing was right. Not when there are all these irksome bees buzzing about. Hey, aren't you the one always trailing behind Burning Gum? That's me. Thanks for noticing. As if you had to ask. I'm here to lend a hand, of course. If you want to help, how about fixing our dorm which your superior laid waste to? Sorry, I'm afraid that's out of my purview. Didn't Burning Gum put a hit out on us before? You ought to compensate us for emotional distress. <sighs> I'm very disappointed in you all. We're all paid employees working for the same people. You really ought to be more trusting of me. Honey, everybody's ganging up on me. Why don't you put a stop to them? I thought you'd want to defend my honor. What are you really doing out here? Are you conducting surveillance? Or trying to turn up information on Mary? <sighs> now, now. Don't get your stinger in a tangle, busy little bee. Fine. I can see none of you are in the mood for repartee. You asked if I wanted information. That's precisely what I'm after. If not that, then what else? At this point, it's about all you can offer me. You don't have a problem with that, do you? After all, sharing information isn't a one-way street. Let me put it this way. If you scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. If you do that, you might be able to receive some top secret information about a certain deputy chief in the process. So let's say... What's a good example? Ah, got it. The fact that there are zero survivors on the surface. That's a bald-faced lie. In truth, there's a lost utopia where humans have gathered and are living quite happily. Were you not aware of this? The suits at the Ark have known about it for a coon's age. <laughs> you mean someplace other than the amusement park? Amusement park? What's she on about? So you want confirmation? What's in it for me? It's certainly tempting. But we have to keep our mission strictly confidential. We don't want any leaks. It should be okay if we keep it between us. How about if we use some kind of secret code? Nice! Let's do that! From now on, our code name for our destination is Sewage. As for the item we're after, we'll call it Cartridge Cake. You do realize I can hear everything you're saying.
with me on your team. Did you expect anything else? Understood. I'm going! Route them in their entirety, yes? Fancy a drink? I'm going! Do I have to fight? Whatever. I'll just do what I can. Scornful Dunderheads dare step forward.
Another victory for the commander! Here I go. I'm going! You want me to go there? Understood. Ugh. Do I have to fight? No need to fear. Litter is here. Fleeting as it may be. Reloaded! Excuse me! Oh, crazy yourself! Everyone will give a clue! Everything you've got! A drink. Here I go. Understood. Let's do this. Can I attack now? Distribution draws near. One more victory for both and me! You want me to go there? Let's go, Bolt! Understood. You want me to go there? I'm going! You want me to go there?
Let's go, Bolt. Here I go. Here I go. You want me to go there? Anything else? Let's go, Bolt. Understood. I'm going. Route them in their entirety. Yes. Enemy sighted. Two kilometers. Nearly there. <sighs> is all of this really necessary? Absolutely. Security is of utmost importance. Let's not do this. How about an open exchange of information? Both sides. One question, one answer. What are you all looking for? No, wait. First, tell me about... Sewage. It's where sewer water flows from? Are you for real right now? It's a place where heretics are created. What? Is that true? Nope. It's actually an engineering lab where they've managed to replicate the corruption codes for raptures. <sighs> You're not pulling my leg again, are you? Yep. Fine. Let me just ask one thing. Are you not curious about the information I have? It's about the survivors up on the surface. We're talking about people who have managed to thrive for decades in an environment where not a single inch of land has been recaptured in the Ark's entire history. Then why are you doing this to me? I'm trying to reach a compromise here that will benefit both of us. Can't you give me something to go on? Anything? Why not?
But even if that happens, it would all be in mankind's best interests. Sorry, but that's something we can't get behind. Not Master, nor any of us. Believe that Marion should be dissected, even if it is for a greater cause. <sighs> well, it's not like we'll be able to keep it much of a secret once we reach the coordinates anyway. Which of you scornful dunderheads dare step forward?
Can I attack now? Anything else?
Hello, Bolt. I'm raring to go. Let's go, Bolt. Here I go. They are as candles. The better burnt out. The hour of retribution draws near. Lay off the candles. Oh! Raise me so that all stronger shooting! You must persevere. them in their entirety, yes? Looks like we caught a break. Sewage security is down. Maybe things will go more smoothly this time around. Let's not count our eggs before they hatch. The fact that the security systems have been disabled could mean someone has already been here. Fishy. And it ain't the sewage. Enough with the sewage bit. I already know it's the research center. You can stop using that stupid code word. Sorry. Guess we just got used to it. If the layout of this place is anything like a regular research center, we'll have to go up a few floors. Alright, let's go get ourselves a cartridge case. Do you have hands in your pants or something?
fancy a drink? Anything else? case you guys are after. Is it Vop House? Yep. What? Drats, did I just reveal something I shouldn't have? No, you're fine. You seem to know an awful lot about Vop House already. Honey, come here and look at this. Unlike some people, I'm willing to share certain information. this out. So 
sounds like we're in the right place. Heretic. Anakiro. So, Modernia isn't the only heretic in the world? Of course not. How many more are there? Nice try. You're not getting anything out of me until you cough up some information first. How about that? Suddenly I'm not so curious. I figured as much. Building 9. That's close to us.
retribution draws near. Retribution draws near. Fancy a drink? You want me to go there? Sprout them in their entirety, yes? Bolt! Follow me! Oh! Great Rico show them oh, no force! Fancy a drink? Understood. Ugh. Do I have to fight? Are you in danger? Let me at him!
is also my specialty. All crazy rebuilds are show them no force. from raptures. What if it isn't a rapture? Papillon might have been just a cover, while Papillon Mark II was really following us. Please, if anything, that'd be a blessing. Enemy sighted! I knew something was up! Isabel, cover the commander. Be good, and hold still. Haran, tie up the knee case. Crows, attack. Noah, block all escape routes. <laughs> My favorite. Pilgrims, what's going on here? You don't get to ask questions. If anything, you should be apologizing! Bursting in here and trying to steal what others have worked so hard to find! Wait a minute. Are you talking about Bop House? Maybe you're not as dumb as you look. Commander Johan. What should we do with them? Hmm... I'm going to ask you some questions. If you want to live, I expect proper answers. Who are you? Not answering. Good. Next question. You say you're a commander from the Ark. You could stay burrowed underground, safe from harm. This is an item used to kill heretics. Why on earth would someone like you want this? <laughs> what are you on about? Vapaus destroys the nanomachines inside a heretic's body. In doing that, it disrupts their regenerative abilities. So, if you were to use this on the Nikkeis inside the Ark... You could remove their nymph, freeing them from the endless cycle of resurrection, liberating them. I see now. All right, last question. Which do you think is more important? The liberation of Nikkeis, 
recapturing the surface. Is that right? Then I believe we're done here. You may die now. than mine. Your puny little bullets won't put a dent in it. Damn you! She's right. I can't even put a scratch on it. What should I do? What else? We plow our way through that thing no matter what it takes. Leave the rest of them to the raptures. We're going back to Eden. Yes, Commander. Get him! Don't worry.
completed. Fancy a drink? Understood. Here I go. You want me to get on it? Wait, that didn't come out right. Here I go. Let's go, bro. Let's do this! No need to fear. Literary is here. The power of my prayer is a problem. Oh, great, great, great. Show them oh, no fear. a drink. Here I go. Everybody get ready. Sorry for being so rough back there. I know we've met before, but considering you're in my neck of the woods, allow me to introduce myself properly. My name is Haran. I'm a pilgrim serving Eden, a sort of sanctuary up on the surface. No real reason. Just felt like it, I suppose. Gotta entertain myself somehow. That he did. 
but I wanted to save you, so that's that. We try not to get too involved in other people's affairs. So long as we're willing to face the consequence, we're free to do as we wish. That's our rule. Very much so. But then again, if the rules were the same as the Ark, how could we call this place paradise? That's right. It's a sacred place on the surface where Nikkeis and humans coexist peacefully. If you think a Nikkei defying her commander due to her changing her mind is wild, then just wait till you get to Eden. You'll see stuff way crazier than that. What do you think? Would you like me to take you there? Of course. Why? Are you afraid he'll hurt you? Uh. There's a saying that the blind are brave. Seems to describe you to a T. Well, this sounds like it'll be quite the spectacle. I'm looking forward to it. Follow me then. Try to keep up. Which of you scornful dunderheads dare step forward? Oh, crazy results! Uh, Show them oh, no quarter! Cool. You are out of harm's way. Fleeting as it may be. Fancy a drink? shall not be made light of. Fancy a drink? I'm Route them in their entirety, yes? Scornful dunderheads dare step forward. Oh, great results! An all-powerful tool. You must persevere. Everything you've got! 
Is it enough for fighting? Understrout them in their entirety, yes? You are out of harm's way. Oh, crazy me so powerful powerful tools! The hour of retribution draws near. You must persevere. Oh, crazy results and an all powerful tool! Fancy a drink? shall not be made light of. Oh, crazy results are Show them no portal. You must persevere. Focus. The hour of retribution draws near. A drink. Here I go. Ugh. Do I have to fight? Here we go. Don't worry. The 
Fancy a drink? That's 
much better. You can come out now. As I should be. Only the strong survive up here. You won't get to the top of the food chain by being weak, that's for sure. As strong as I am. You of all people should know, considering that knuckle sandwich he gave you. At first, he was a weak human, much like yourself. But then he swapped his broken bones and tattered skin for mechanical parts. He even managed to cover up all the gaps resulting from the surgeries. Before I met him, I thought all humans were doomed to be prey for all eternity. Thanks to him, I've come around slightly on that. He's obsessed with reclaiming the surface. The thought of it has consumed him entirely, more than anyone else I've seen. For him, reclaiming the surface will never come to pass if it's left to bureaucrats pontificating over it during their lunch meetings. Sunshine. The smell of the grass. The flow of the water and the wind-swept valleys on a breezy day. He intends for all of it to come to pass by his hand alone. Achieving this is his entire purpose in life. He's willing to do anything to make his dream a reality. <clears throat> now, let me ask you something. Are you not a commander, sent from the Ark to recapture the surface as well? Yet, even with Vapaus within your grasp, you claimed you'd use it instead to liberate the Nikes. What if, as a result, a heretic survives? And threatens your precious homestead and its people? What would you do then? Hmm... And does that include... <sighs> How disappointing. If there is anything of less value than a human life, I do not know of it. better burnt out. You must persevere.
Pick up another victory for the commander! shall not be made light of. as it may be.
Sprout them in their entirety, yes? I will look over everything. 
everyone. We are about to move forward. Fancy a drink? Let's go, Bolt! Incoming encounter! Is that right? to get on it. We're here. Of course, it's not paradise. I'm going to put you through a little test. That's right. During our chat on the way here, I was trying to figure you out. But words alone won't suffice. 
For example, giving one's life to a cause is something that cannot be proven using words alone. So I, Haran, as a Watcher of Paradise, will conduct a trial that will be a true test of your resolve. Humans reveal who they truly are when faced with the death. I will help set the stage for you. Before that, however, we must first ensure the monster you're going up against is somewhat docile. Come with me, human. For the first step, your ability as a commander will be put to the test. Distribution draws near. You must persevere. Oh, Raise your group at all powerful tools! You are out of harm's way. Oh, Raise your group at all powerful tools! Your bravery is admirable. You have passed the first step. Don't rush me. I'll get to it when I get to it. Come to think of it, this may be a bit advanced for you. That, 
should be a little more suitable for you. What? Does the idea seem absurd to you? If so, then let me posit a question for you. The paradise that you're imagining, where Nikes and humans live in harmony? Is it a place where Nikes serve humans unilaterally? As humans can't even defend themselves against raptures who are already at death's door. Then, prove it. Show me that you can be self-sufficient. And you'll be allowed into paradise. No need to worry. I knew this would happen, so I packed some items that might prove useful. Take your pick. It's been four hours already. For goodness sake, something has to happen soon. Either kill the raptures or die. I can't look at this anymore. I'd rather watch the paint dry. I'll go make some essence. Maybe by then something will have happened. essence and this human is still surviving perhaps this one isn't a complete fool but no one's luck lasts forever hmm. this is just as boring as it was before crow let's go make some witches brew A stalemate. I made enough soup for two people. Just in case. You want some? <sighs> About time this test ended. I can't take it for much longer. You've all played your part admirably. And for that, I shall give you a fitting end. The human doesn't seem to be moving. I suppose no matter how strong one's willpower is, it won't allow you comfortably to carry a firearm meant for a Nike. Your turn now. I will send you off as a last courtesy. Hmm... What is this? Hmm... Very interesting. I can't say I've seen this before. A human who has passed out standing up. At any rate, since they survived. I'll consider it a pass.
Hey there. How are you feeling? I took care of them. To celebrate you passing the test unscathed. Continue following this path, and it'll lead you straight to paradise. From here on, you'll be on your own. Are you up to it? All right, then. Off you go. There's someone waiting for you. I'm sure they'll be there to greet you the moment you arrive. Hmm. Welcome to Paradise. them in their entirety, yes?
I've got your back. Draws near. Oh, crazy results so all powerful tools. Victory! With me on your team, did you expect anything else? Anything else? Cecil. I'm listening. We have secured Unchained. Uh, about time. I expected someone as skilled as you to be somewhat more expedient. Bring it over here. Hmm. This is Vop House. I'm sure of it. Is it enough to take down Nihilister? 
That all depends on you. If you can tag her with one shot, then yes. It's enough. One shot. I almost wasted it all for nothing. Hmm? What do you mean? I ran into a commander from the Ark at the research center. Some greenhorn with four Nikes in tow. Said they were going to use Vaphouse to liberate the Nikes. So, what did you do? I left them to the Raptures to help them, shall we say, come to their senses. Huh. Sounds like something you'd do. I wonder what's gotten into that commander's head. If they ever got one good look at the Nikes here, they'd know what a blessing Nymph can be. Not least of all Dorothy. She is the bane of my existence. She's always up to no good. Worst of all, she has the ear of all the other Nikes. Have you heard of her latest escapade? She brought outsiders to Eden without so much as a word to me. Outsiders? Yes, and... Not even one or two. Five in total. I'm willing to bet that one of them is the commander you intended to turn into rapture food. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're thinking. It's a bit too coincidental, don't you think? Let's hold off for now and see how far Dorothy goes with her little antics. Welcome. You're now in paradise. Official code name: Eden. Consider me your guide. You can call me Dorothy. Anyone who can pass Haran's test is an extraordinary individual. Capable of bringing forth great change to the surface. I always pay close attention to whoever passes. Relax. No one will force you into accepting any major missions without your consent. Now, come over here. Considering this fine weather we're having, let's take a stroll in the gardens first. Doesn't the sunshine feel lovely? This garden contains 93 types of trees, 13 different species of livestock, and all manner of edible foodstuffs. Although Eden is built in the middle of a wasteland, we've created a near-perfect replica of how things were prior to the Rapture invasion, all thanks to genetic modification and certain cultivation methods. Care to try some? What do you think? You won't find these kinds of flavors in the Ark. Help yourself to as many as you like. This is the Central Research Facility. You remember the Nikkeis you ran into? I mean, the ones that were with Johan. I'm not sure if you noticed, but they are pilgrims, manufactured using advanced technology. Cecil created them with her own hands in this very room. Surprising, isn't it? Apparently, the Ark is still 50 years away from achieving this kind of technology. She even designed the optical camouflage that envelops this entire base. Last but not least, we have the lobby. You can see the entire base from here. Hmm... Ah, it seems that Isabel and Noah are training in the incubator. It works rather like the ARC simulation room, but it's possible to make even finer adjustments and create slightly more powerful enemies there. Actually, that's not entirely correct. When I say slightly more powerful, we're talking about the difference between run-of-the-mill raptures and tyrant class. 
Very true. However, such difficulty spikes are necessary for us. Everyone who resides in Eden must be able to fend for themselves. This even applies to humans like Cecil and Johan. In doing this, we avoid becoming like your Ark, where the few are being exploited by the many. You catch on quickly. To me, Paradise is a place where there is an even balance of power, where humans and Nikes can live in perfect harmony. Of course, everyone has their own definition of what is just. So, what do you think? Did Paradise live up to what you envisioned in your mind? I'm curious to hear how you think it compares. Is that so? Nevertheless, it's at least closer to Utopia than the Ark, is it not? Well then, I suppose we can move on to more important topics. Hmm. I don't know if you heard from Haran, but I have been waiting a long time for your arrival. I believe you are the key to overcoming the crisis that befalls Eden. The heretics. You have gone up against one of them before and won, have you not? I and many others consider it a victory. Anyway, this heretic that is calling itself Modernia I suppose I should be straight with you. There is another heretic, a member of the Queen's elite forces. Hatred for humanity burns deep within her, and she has set her sights on Eden. Codename, Nihilister. We have had five previous engagements with her, and every confrontation has ended in a stalemate. Now that the Vapaus has been secured, we have a greater chance than before. But we cannot allow Eden's entire destiny to rest solely on a single bullet. According to one of my old friends, you're something of a miracle worker, someone who's achieved the impossible several times over. My hope is that you can lend us some of that expertise. In return, we can promise anything. Haran tells me that you want the Vapaus. We can give it to you. However, as you know, it is the only one of its kind. Therefore, whether you take it back to the Ark, or use it in the battle to defeat the heretic, is a decision I shall leave to you. No, he doesn't know anything about this yet. But don't worry. I'll be able to persuade him. So, what do you want to do? Tell me. Are you referring to the others? That we brought to the base a while ago? I'm bored stiff. Do you want me to make you some witch soup? your boo-boos and make it all better. Mm. 
Why are you kissing my forehead? You just said you should kiss boo-boos to make them better. I figured there was something wrong with your brain, so I thought a smooch there might help. Very funny. We managed to pass that deranged test of theirs. Individually, I might add. That numbskull with the shield said if we managed to pin her to the ground, we could pass. That motor mouth was the worst part of the entire ordeal. We couldn't shut her up if we tried. I had to take down a flying bomber. It was so hard. What? How did you make it out in one piece? In the heat of battle, you must have turned to firepower as your savior, right? But why subject humans to the same test? What do they have against you? I don't see the point in trying to weed out people like this. If you really think it over, I suppose I can see where they're coming from. They only want to be with those who have proven themselves. But to try and say that they're helping us by doing all this... Is a bit rich. Did Haran mention her great plan to you? What are you planning on doing? To be honest, I'm leaning towards turning her down. But if we decline, then we may lose our only opportunity to get our hands on Baopas. Pulling you. I'm sure you're not keen on taking on all of Eden. I guess it's decided then. If it's a heretic, we'd have to go up against them eventually anyway, right? You do realize that if we accept their proposal, we're aligning ourselves with that psychopath Johan, don't you? <sighs> hmm. What if he tosses Master out of another window? I'd like to see him try. If he does, we'll toss him even further. I should practice my throws. I've been told that... You've agreed to our proposition? Excellent. I have good news for you as well. I was successful in persuading Cecil about our deal. The operation to exterminate the heretic will take place tomorrow. I felt it would be easier to sway Cecil. Usually, when Cecil makes a decision, then the commit I mean, Johan typically agrees. Slight disagreements are commonplace during operations such as this. But I'll be there to mediate should any such instances occur, so there's no need to worry. As a gesture of trust, allow me to bestow this upon you. The first bullet is Vapaus. Don't forget. Make sure you don't use it unless it is absolutely necessary. Why are you doing this? Why give us the Vapaus? We could run off in the middle of the night and take it along with us. It's hard to explain. None of you seem like someone who would do such a thing. Also, if something like that were to happen, we have a tracker who can take to the skies and reach mock speed. I assure you, she always nabs her prey. I knew I could count on you. You mustn't be nervous about tomorrow's operation. We may have never won against a heretic, but by the same token, we've never lost either. Now that we've got an ace up our sleeve, I'm certain that victory is within our grasp. Do you want me to go there?
So, you want to bring me to the surface again?